Okay, so picking up from our last clip, uh, we've just pasted in the uh, pages controls section from our mojo portal web.config into our project web.config to help it resolve some of the controls that we want to use. So we don't need to keep this file open, so we'll go ahead and fix that. And then we'll look back here. Uh, right now, we don't have a reference to log for net. We're not using it in this thing, and we haven't yet created a business layer, so we'll copy that out for now. Um, title control is complaining about, but it should now see title control. So we'll try build, and it's not liking, oh, we haven't set a reference to mojoportal.web.framework yet. We haven't needed it yet. Uh, but now our project should build. Mm -hmm, maybe not. Title control. Okay, we do need mojoportal.business because we're already talking in modules, and that's a business object. So we want to add a couple more references. We're going to add a reference to mojoportal.business, mojoportal.business.webhelpers. I had a reference to mojoportal.web.framework. And let's see if that will help us resolve this build problem. Okay, the title control is often kind of troublesome. Um, Sometimes I find that if I go to design view, it can resolve the designer file. It's probably got the correct reference. It's treating that like a generic control instead of seeing it from the web.config. So sometimes doing that and then going back will resolve it. Other times you can go directly into the designer.cs file if needed and coerce it into knowing what that control is. Okay, it worked. So if I go back to source view now, because if it didn't work, it wouldn't it wouldn't have rendered that. So I just went back to source view. All right, let us try the build again. Title control does not exist. All right, it still doesn't like it. Oops, how did I jump out of Visual Studio? This really gets in my way. Um, control is right here. It's module title. And basically, where that is coming from is this control right here. So we do web.ui. And our Hello Web project should recognize that because in our web.config file we have portal for module portal.web.ui. So let's see what is it doing in the designer file. Is it not declaring? It hasn't declared that control, even though we went to design view and it was able to show it. Ah, here's a problem. Our designer file didn't quite get adapted to our namespace. And it didn't get adapted to our... Oh, actually, we didn't name this how we wanted it. We just got a little bit of repair work to do here. And then here, we got to say, yeah, that looks correct. Now, let's close out of that designer file. We're really not supposed to have to uh, touch the designer file. Occasionally we do anyway. Yeah, but let's try going back and see. Let's see if it builds better now.
but still does not want to show. Well, what we can do is copy one from another module and just put it in there and it really shouldn't be this difficult. <laughs> Really, all of this stuff ought to be showing up in there. Title one. The only is it's called Title one. Now, okay. Again, this shouldn't have been necessary, but you can always coerce it if you need. Now, how are we doing on time? I feel like I've used up a lot of time. Seven, eight minutes already. We can only go ten minutes. Um, so we will uh, quickly show how we need to add a post build event. Um, and we can copy it from uh, web store and we're going to need this bar right here now we'll go up to our project Events. And we'll paste it in and modify it. And let's see what was our folder in guest or uh, All right, our DLL is going to be acme.web.ui. And we don't have a business or data layer yet, so I'm just going to chop that out. We don't yet have an SPX or ASCX, ASHX, I mean, we do have uh, this book, and we want to copy it to a new folder named guest book. So we'll say OK, the entire build, it succeeded, and now if we look under modulePortal.web, we should see guest book. And we might need to refresh our view. Of course, it wants to expand everything, but there's our guestbook folder and our controller copy. I'm going to stop the clip right here. I'll see you in the next clip.